Here is my principle of KPI usage number four out of five. And that's quite, quite interesting. Um, let's start with two different situations, okay? Um, situation number one, imagine this. You are a team of recruiters, okay? And you have your annual meeting and you have a look at your, let's say, time to fill. And you realize time to fill now is on average 50 days, okay? And now you, you think about whether you could do better. And in the team, you think of, hey, next year, let's go for 45. Let's reduce time to fill. Let's look whether we can be better on that. So it's a goal that you, that you have agreed on by yourself in the team. So in the following month, of course, you're going to look at time to fill and see how you're doing and whether you are can be happy with what you achieve. This is scenario number one. Scenario number two is the following. Your CEO asks you, how is our time to fill? Please report this. And you say, mm, it's, it's 50 days. And then the CEO says, ah, 50 days. I think you can do better. You have to achieve 45 because I want it that way. And I want reports every quarter where you are. Okay, so it's the same KPI, it's the same target, both time it's really relevant. But what's the, what's the difference between the two situations? Situation number one is, is about feedback. You use the KPI as a basis for feedback. Scenario number two is about control. And feedback and control are completely different different games and they lead to completely different social dynamics. Regarding scenario number two, when a KPI is used for control purpose, we know that you always get what you want. You put the figures right and if the CEO wants 45 days, okay, he gets 45 days, no matter what, because you want to fulfill this. And you know if you don't meet this, there are going to be some extrinsic consequences. So that's a different game than reflecting on how can we get better and where we currently are and so. So internal reflection based on a KPI which is used for feedback is a completely different game than using a KPI for extrinsic control. I think we should consider this. Uh, we too often think about KPIs in a too technical way. I think the more interesting point is to think about KPIs in a more psychological way.